Dear friends, welcome back for another tutorial. This one is following the previous one, a Guitar 4, about the use of M-Wave Chocolate pedal for controlling Mightier Amp Up, and through that also the new X Mighty devices like new X Mighty Air that I have here, and also new X Mighty Plugs MP2 and P Pro, so, MP Pro, so it is valid for all of this. Now another uh, step uh, forward that you have been requiring uh, quite uh, quite strongly. Uh, it is possible with the new wave chocolate pedal to plug in an external expression pedal, and this is also usable with uh, with the Mighty Amp as well and with the new X devices as well. So let me show you how to do it. I will not repeat what we have been. Uh, explaining during the previous tutorial so please have a look at the previous one for details about how to configure and weigh pedal and so on so very quickly just open bluetooth start your bluetooth in your bluetooth connect the pedal of course it must be on so connect it now it is connected return to your at least open coop suite up as we did before Send, uh, select foot control and uh, con and verify that uh, the it is uh, configured as program change b this is uh, working also for for these devices for or for the use of the external pedal so let's go out from the app now we need to disconnect the M-Wave from the main Bluetooth, so disconnect it. You see that the light returns linking, that is very important. If not, turn it off and on as already explained. Now we can open the Mightier Amp up. You see that the app is connected because it is connecting to the um, Mighty Air, in this case, you see that if I change a program clicking on the screen, it will do it. You may remember that we configured the pedal to be the same with the A to go back and the D button to go forward. Now we can take a step forward, that is connecting also the expression pedal. It must be inserted in the in this uh, 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 port that is named the pedal, so you just need to plug the jack in, and then go into the mighty ramp up, push the setting tabs, the um, rightmost one on the bottom list, settings, scroll down to remote control, press remote control. You see foot control is already visible, we have been configuring it in the previous tutorial. So let's push configuration, the gear, and press this time parameter hot keys, the third menu we have not been using in the first review. Now it is possible to select any of these parameters. These are uh, parameters with different uh, values, they are not only on off. That is why they are good to be configured with the expression pedal. You can use different parameters. You see that uh, Tuntorius, uh, the developer of this amp, that we need to thank every day for this, uh, for this app uh, provided, uh, uh, attached to any parameter an I symbol, you can push it and you can see what uh, that parameter will do in the different configurations. For example, if I select uh, amplifier parameter 1, you see that this will change the gain for all the available, uh, the available amplifiers within, within uh, our device. If I select amplifier parameter 2, the info tells me that this will change the level. For star lift, for example, it will only change the mid frequency, so it can be different according to the, uh, to the selected amplifier. What I will do is select the cabinet, the cabinet uh, um, level, so this way I can change the volume. I know it's not uh, the most interesting uh, configuration available, it is just to show you how to do it. You can configure any other parameter 
associated to the pedal, uh, whatever you prefer, as you wish. Now I need just to move the pedal. You see that the value is changing. Uh, it's not a problem because it is always CC0 and then the following number shows uh, what is the value in percentage from 0 to 265, that is the maximum, the, the maximum value. So just uh, keep it like that. It is already selected. I'm keeping it uh, on the bottom line. Push OK. Now it is associated to cabinet level. If we go to the main screen, so back, back, you will press Editor tab to return to the main screen. Again, the pedal can switch the selection. Now, as you may remember, we associated this to the to the cabinet level, so it is associated to the our uh, IR input response. So I'm selecting IR to show you the bar. And if I move the pedal, you see that the bar can increase and decrease according to the position the level is configured at. Uh, one important note, you need to set the multiplication here. Uh, these pedals have normally a, three, um, a knob here that you can uh, rotate to select uh, the, the multiply, the, the scale, the, the, the highest scale, the, the better the result. You see, if I slow this down, for example, to the minimum, the pedal will only allow me to change between zero, uh, between the, 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 the lowest level and just a few more. So to set it this, put it to the maximum and rotate the, the, the toggle, the, 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 the knob, until you get 6 dB, that is the maximum allowed level. And this way you can have the full scale available. That's all for that. Uh, just a brief description of the pedal I have been using here. This is uh, the M Audio pedal. Uh, I purchased it uh, online. It is available in different stores, uh, Toman, uh, Strumenti Musicali, and many others. I purchased it uh, to test this. Frankly speaking, it's very inexpensive. The quality, of course, is not the, the, the best available, but it, it, it does the job. It is very inexpensive, as I said, because it is around $15 at the moment. And uh, by the way, you can have a look here to know what is the, the detail. You can find it very easily, but in the description of the video, I will let you know exactly the, the name of the, of the tooling. Uh, one important thing, this pedal has uh, two possible positions, two selections with this toggle. Keep it on M Audio, so the standard configuration, so it will work as shown in the, in the video. I hope you found this useful. Of course, uh, you can use different expression pedal. I've been using the M Audio because it is very inexpensive. And you know from the beginning that my purpose is to show you a complete configuration that can be used on the go without spending a lot of money. Uh, my thanks again to Tuntorius for providing my tier ramp up. Without that, uh, nothing of this will be possible. Join me in supporting him. Consider also donating him in his GitHub uh, website. You will find the link in the description below. Thank you again for watching. I hope you find this uh, useful. Uh, please give me comments uh, below for ask me for different tutorials for other details if something was not clear please feel free to let me know i will do my best to to fix it thank you again for watching and my best wishes of an happy new year with your family with your friends bye bye to everybody